Hey everyone, this Amos back here again. And as you can see in front of me is the HTC One. And if you guys haven't heard, uh, the new uh, update to the Android system is coming out for the HTC One. And I have uh, T-Mobile as my carrier. And they finally, as you can see, the update to for uh, Android 4.4 KitKat has arrived. As you can see, these, it says system update is available. So let's unlock my phone. I'm going to unlock my phone. And I will click here. And as you can see, it says system update. And software update 4.19. Point five thirty one point ten, and as you can see, it's four point four point two update. So let's go ahead and download this. And I'm actually going to pause the video right now, and so that they can download. So as you can see, it's still downloading, but I have ninety four percent left in the update in the download all right so we have it's says that it's completed and verifying the system update let's see if there's anything that here so let's just see clicking on one of these or do anything Okay, so it says download successful, verifying package, and it just, just goes over all of the updates, what it includes. It looks like security enhancement, there's printing improvements of cloud printing service, there's Bluetooth improvements, and let's just push OK. Now the phone is restarting. I'm very interested of seeing what is going to be the new how uh, and how Android KitKat is going to be. Looks like it's just going to do a verification. Looks like it's just uh, installing it right now. I think I'll pause the video here until it finishes installing. All right, looks like it finished installing. It just restarted. So let's see. Let's see what's going to happen next. Or is it installing again? Hmm. The anticipation is killing me. It looks like it's installing again. Well, it's actually quicker this time. Uh, now restarted. So hopefully, when this, when the phone boots back up, we can experience Android KitKat. Oh, 
What's going on here? Restart it again. Hmm. Ah, there we go. HTC One Beats Audio. Okay, now it's saying Android is upgrading, optimizing app, and then it has 23 of 82. starting apps now a lot of updating of databases looks like let's see if I can zoom in closer oh never mind all right so here we are here's my lock screen one thing that I notice off the bat Nothing really has changed. Let's open this. The lock screen has changed. It used to be all black when I was when I had my lock screen, but now it has my background. Now let's see. Anything else has changed? No. Let's see. My blink feed has changed. Nope. Nothing has. Let's change my blank feed. Uh, one thing that I did notice is, oh, here's this. It says, system software update. Congratulations, your phone has been updated successfully to version 4.19.531.10. Okay. Uh, one thing, let's see. One thing that I do notice is that... Okay, uh, one thing I do notice is that this icon, this grid icon on the top right corner is different. So let's push that. Push that. The grid thing is still the same as the previous version of Android. Let's check out these settings. Looks like the settings is all the same from the previous Android. Let's go to the uh, about and go just to make sure that this is the version. Yep, as you can see right here. It says right there, Android version 4.4.2. And the, the latest update actually from HTC, they have uh, upgraded the uh, HTC Sense to 5.5. Let's go back here and see if there's anything new as well.
So let's actually look at my apps here. See if there's anything different here. Uh, first thing I see that's new is right here. Uh, there's a app called Drive. Let's click on that and see what that is. Go to Drive. See your HTC device comes with up to 40 gigabytes of Google Drive. Okay, Google Drive storage for free for two years. So I can redeem that. I might do that later. Let's go back to here. Anything else? Uh, I've also seen some new apps here. Uh, I see HTC apps and also HTC backup. Let's click on the apps and see what that what that is. No new apps are available on this device. Let's click up here. These are probably uh, apps that you get from HTC, I believe. So I don't have anything, I don't think. But let's just... Nothing here. Okay, let's go back. Let's go HTC Backup right here. It says, HTC Backup saves your phone settings to the cloud. Restores your settings when you you replace or upgrade your phone. Oh, that's pretty nice. Let's exit that. We'll do that later. And now continue to see if there's anything new. Nothing is new on here. And nothing else is new. Oh yeah, so that is the, as you can see, yeah, that Android KitKat has arrived to HTC One for T-Mobile. And I just want to give you just a little, this, this little quick little, um, little update of the phone. Yeah, I'm still liking the phone. It's a very, very nice phone. Um, I've been very, 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 very happy with it. Um, yeah, so if, as always, guys, if you like these videos that I'm doing, go ahead and hit that like button at the bottom and leave a comment below if you want to see some more videos of me doing my tech reviews um and anyways uh yeah so until the next time guys hope you guys like these videos and just continue to keep on watching my vlogs and everything else uh that's this is going to be amos signing off thank you guys